Turks and Caicos is seeing a spike in migrants trying to illegally enter the TCI, leading to many issues in the Caribbean country. So they've taken a big step to protect their borders, preventing Haitians from traveling to the Turks and Caicos, even for leisure. Our One Caribbean News, Deandra Hamilton reports. As the UNHCR fights for equality for Caribbean migrants crossing into the United States, the Turks and Caicos announces a big decision in relation to Haiti. Turks and Caicos Islands has placed a moratorium on visitor visas for citizens of Haiti. The six-month freeze, which came into effect on January 11th, will prevent Haitians from traveling to the TCI for leisure, even business purposes. The announcement was made mere days after at least 10 senators in Haiti's parliament stepped down from their positions, leaving the country without any democratic rule. But the Minister for Border Services, Arlington Musgrove, reported that TCI's actions were prompted by more direct challenges from the embattled state. Identified was an increasing number of irregular migrants attempting to enter the TCI over the last year illegally and clandestinely upsurge in violent crimes in Haiti and the TCI. The number of persons repatriated and deported to Haiti recently, a rise in communicable and infectious diseases such as cholera, the hiring of illegal migrants in persons not authorized to work in the TCI by unscrupulous employers, and the noticeable propensity of persons arriving on the islands violating the terms of their visitor's visa by overstaying and engaging in gainful employment, all of which are against the law. Minister Musgrove said the decision was taken to protect the TCI's borders and its people. Recently, TCI Governor Nigel Dakin noted that the stream of migrants and human smuggling operations is overwhelming, citing the 275 illegals were caught and taken into custody over the Christmas holidays. Unknown is how many Haitians may have gotten into the Turks and Caicos undetected. Outside the Haitian Embassy in Nassau, Bahamas on Shirley Street, I'm DeAndre Hamilton reporting.